Well, we've had a transition day today from some sunshine and warm temperatures to a cold front moving through as we speak. We do have still some steady rain, mainly up through portions of St. Clair County and very eastern uh, Macomb County. Otherwise, though, we're starting to see the rain taper off a bit, but it's not completely over yet. We do have just a couple of lighter showers still remaining, but take a look at our temperatures. Our highs today were in the mid to upper 70s, even pushing 80 degrees in Adrian as well as Monroe, but our current temperatures are much cooler. Some of us have dropped already about 20 degrees. Currents are in the 50s through Pontiac, Lapeer, as well as in Howell at this moment. Still holding on to a few 60s on the board, but our temperatures will continue to drop as we move into tonight. Again, the rain continues to move off to the east. It'll be done by about 8 o'clock tonight, so a little less than two more hours. We will see some clearing early, but we'll also have a couple more clouds push in as we get into tomorrow morning. Still going kind of partly cloudy and mostly cloudy overnight tonight, even though this model has us rather clear. We will get to some sunshine, though, by mid to late morning and we'll keep the sunshine throughout the day. So it is going to be sunny again tomorrow. It's just not going to be as warm with some cooler air filtering in. We'll start off the day on a chillier note and actually a day slightly below average. Most of us will be waking up in the 40s, either the upper 40s or even some outlying areas in the low 40s. 41 for Howell in the morning, 43 in Ann Arbor. By the afternoon, it will also be much colder, about 10 degrees colder than what we saw today with highs in the mid to upper 60s. We'll peak at 68 tomorrow and then as we get into Thursday, though, winds change again, so we're back into the 70s. We'll hold into the mid-70s with rain showers on Friday, but then our temperatures drop again into Saturday. We will, thankfully, though, see some sunshine. Then Sunday, temperatures are back up. Then behind that rain, our temperatures drop again. So we're in that kind of phase. It is fall where our temperatures swing up and down depending on the day, usually following the rain because most of these shower chances today, Friday, and Sunday all follow a cold front. So some changes coming, especially tomorrow.